quantiles are values taken at regular intervals from the inverse of the cumulative distribution function of a random variable. Dividing ordered data into essentially equal size data subsets is the motivation for quantiles. The quantiles are the data values marking the boundaries between consecutive subsets. Put another way, the quantile for a random variable is the value such that the probability that the random variable will be less than is at most and the probability that the random variable will be greater than is at most. There are of the quantiles, one for each integer satisfying. Specialized quantiles, some Q quantiles have special names, the two quantile is called the median, the three quantiles are called tertiles or tracials a T, the four quantiles are called quartiles a Q. The five quantiles are called quintiles a q u, the six quantiles are called sextiles a s, the ten quantiles are called deciles a d, the twelve quantiles are called duodeciles a d d, the twenty quantiles are called bigintiles a v, the one hundred quantiles are called percentiles a p, the one thousand quantiles are called permeals a p r. More generally, one can consider the quantile function for any distribution. This is defined for real variables between 0 and 1 and is mathematically the inverse of the cumulative distribution function. Quantiles of a population, for a population of discrete values, or for a continuous population density, the th quantile is the data value where the cumulative distribution function crosses that is, is a th quantile for a variable if and for a finite population of values indexed 1. From lowest to highest, the th quantile of this population can be computed by the value of if is not an integer, then round up to the next integer to get the appropriate index. The corresponding data value is the th quantile. On the other hand, if is an integer then any number from the data value at that index to the data value of the next can be taken as the quantile, and it is conventional to take the average of those two values. If, instead of using integers and the a euro a cantilia euro is based on a real number with, then replaces in the above formulae. Some software programs regard the minimum and maximum as the zeroth and one hundredth percentile, respectively. However, such terminology is an extension beyond traditional statistics definitions. Examples The following two examples use the nearest rank definition of quantile, rounding, see definition under percentiles. Even sized population, consider an ordered population of 10 data values 3, 6, 7, 8, 8, 10, 13, 15, 16, 20. The rank of the first quartile is 10 a, opening round bracket 1 over 4 closing round bracket equals 2.5, which rounds up to 3, meaning that 3 is the rank in the population at which approximately one quarter of the values are less than the value of the first quartile. The third value in the population is 7. The rank of the second quartile is 10 a, opening round bracket 2 over 4 closing round bracket equals 5, which is an integer, while the number of values is an even number, so the average of both the fifth and sixth values is taken a euro that is slash 2 equals 9, though any value from 8 through to 10 could be taken to be the median. The rank of the third quartile is 10 a, opening round bracket 3 over 4 closing round bracket equals 7.5, which rounds up to 8. The eighth value in the population is 15. Odd sized population, consider an ordered population of 11 data values 3, 6, 7, 8, 8, 9, 10, 13, 15, 16, 20. The first quartile is determined by 11 a, opening round bracket 1 over 4 closing round bracket equals 2.75, which rounds up to 3, meaning that 3 is the rank in the population at which approximately one quarter of the values are less than the value of the first quartile. The third value in the population is 7. The second quartile value is determined by 11 a, opening round bracket 2 over 4 closing round bracket equals 5.5 which rounds up to 6. Therefore 6 is the rank in the population at which approximately two quarters of the values are less than the value of the second quartile. The sixth value in the population is 9. The third quartile value for the original example above is determined by 11 a, opening round bracket 3 over 4 closing round bracket equals 8.25, which rounds up to 9. The ninth value in the population is 15. 
Discussion Standardized test results are commonly misinterpreted as a student scoring in the 80th percentile, for example, as if the 80th percentile is an interval to score in, which it is not. One can score at some percentile, or between two percentiles, but not in some percentile. Perhaps by this example it is meant that the student scores between the 80th and 81st percentiles, or in the group of students whose score placed them at the 80th percentile. If a distribution is symmetric, then the median is the mean. But, in general, the median and the mean differ. For instance, with a random variable that has an exponential distribution, any particular sample of this random variable will have roughly a 63% chance of being less than the mean. This is because the exponential distribution has a long tail for positive values but is zero for negative numbers. Quantiles are useful measures because they are less susceptible than means to long tail distributions and outliers. Empirically, if the data being analyzed are not actually distributed according to an assumed distribution, or if there are other potential sources for outliers that are far removed from the mean, then quantiles may be more useful descriptive statistics than means and other moment related statistics. Closely related is the subject of least absolute deviations a method of regression that is more robust to outliers than as least squares, in which the sum of the absolute value of the observed errors is used in place of the squared error. The connection is that the mean is the single estimate of a distribution that minimizes expected squared error while the median minimizes expected absolute error. Least absolute deviations shares the ability to be relatively insensitive to large deviations in outlying observations, although even better methods of robust regression are available. The quantiles of a random variable are preserved under increasing transformations, in the sense that, for example, if as the median of a random variable, then as the median of, unless an arbitrary choice has been made from a range of values to specify a particular quantile. Quantiles can also be used in cases where only ordinal data are available. Estimating the quantiles of a population, there are several methods for estimating the quantiles. The most comprehensive breadth of methods is available in the O and GNU Octave programming languages, which include nine sample quantile methods. SAS includes five sample quantile methods, SciPy includes eight, STATA includes two, and Microsoft Excel includes one. In effect, the methods compute QP, the estimate for the KTHQ quantile, where par equals a car slash AQ from a sample of size n by computing a real valued index h. When h is an integer, the hth smallest of the n values, xh, is the quantile estimate. Otherwise a rounding or interpolation scheme is used to compute the quantile estimate from h. Xiaosh Hor and Xiao Hor per mil, estimate types include, note that a 3 and a 4 do not give high equals a, na plus a1, a slash a2 when pa equals a1 half. The standard error of a quantile estimate can in general be estimated via the bootstrap. The Maritz Jarrett method can also be used. See also, flash sort to euro sort by first bucketing by quantile, descriptive statistics, quartile, QQ plot, quantile function, quantile normalization, quantile regression, summary statistics, references. Further reading, RJ. Surfling. Approximation Theorems of Mathematical Statistics. John Wiley & Sons, 1980. External links, MATLAB Implementation of the Various Estimation Methods.